Okay, we're back. Uh, I was kind of split up wondering if I should play just some multiplayer today and maybe or maybe not record it, try to get my uh, readiness up a bit more, or if um, I should just go ahead and try to do this one mission and then do some multiplayer and maybe, you know, turn in the last side quest that I got and go talk with Ashley on the Citadel or whatever. You know, like I wasn't sure like if I could do it after. But reading what's on the screen right here, it's kind of making me feel like, uh, you know, it says once the attack is launched, the Alliance will be fully committed to the final fight against the Reapers. Assault the base when ready. So that sounds like, yeah, you start this, there's no turning back, and everything else is pretty much screwed. So with that in mind, I'm just going to kind of do a short session, uh, you know, just run around, talk to everybody, go to the Citadel. Commander. You know, the usual stuff. I think I got like two things I can turn in. These two I can turn in. And I'm not sure where I should find this. If I even care. I really kind of don't care about these. I'll turn in those and talk to what's her face. If she's not drunk. Everyone's getting drunk, I swear. I should I should go get drunk too. Look at all that texture loading on that planet. That was... That was interesting. But, uh, yeah. So, I'm just kind of like... Want to just go ahead and mop up several things. I still... Holy crap, just looking at this map. Actually, wow, we're down to... Well, that's one. So, one, two, three, four, five. That one that was way over there. That one's taken up, so we're... I mean, look at this galaxy map. It's just all reapered out. So, assault the elusive man's base. That is so tempting. I have a lot of time today, so I want to do it, but my readiness is pretty poopy. So I'll show you in a little bit, because it's like... It's, it's, it's just not what I would want it to be. So I got like, what, like 70, 75%? So it's like... You know, I have 6,000 assets, but I have under 5,000 that I guess are like actually ready to do stuff. So I might as well just do whatever, try to get get it up. You know. Uh, so yeah, I mean, I, I suppose I'll be beating the game tomorrow then, which is nifty. So I'll be beating it Friday, depending on how much time I get. I actually got a lot of time kind of shoved in my face today which is surprising you're cleared to dock normandy and today's a thursday transport for the record and no because i have no idea where i'm going as usual or i can just start from the bottom up because i don't know where what's her face is going to meet me anyway i need a cab to the presidium it'll be there momentarily yay actually what i should do is go to the stupid specter office and be like hey are there any more, you know, like random things I can buy before I work my way up to that area? And the game's like, oh, hey, here's some missions that you missed out on. Congratulations. Oh, God, and all the shopping I can do here is so, so dangerous. Let me see Ashley Liara. So Ashley's down here. I, I want to go. I'm just going to go check the Spectre office right quick. How much money do I even have? I'm still destitute. Spectre status recognized. That's right, because I, I went off and did some shopping. So I went and I bought upgraded versions of a bunch of my guns. So all the ones that like I primarily use. I cannot decide which shotgun I like the most, though. I mean, if I could just get that Claymore to have, like, two shots, I would love it. But I think I should just, I should just pump all my money into the, into the Wraith. No, I know what I said. Trust me. Oh, that conversation's looping. Cause we've been to the Citadel so many freaking times. Let me in. The camera just glitched out. Oh no. Shepherd, human. Is there anything important on here anyway? Officer, somebody. Yep. Yep. Uh, yeah, is that then? I'm so broke. I can't even. I can't even imagine it. All these were already authorized, right? Let me see, what is this? Transfer authorization, private Televi. Private Televi has transferred to a unit actively engaged against Reaper hostiles. A note from Sergeant Blah 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 says that Private is an exceptional engineer, recommending her for duty on a team set to sabotage Reaper Processing Center, Spectre, 
Spectre authorization would fast track this request. Sure, if I'm not mistaken, that is the person that is on the same level as my ship. If that, I think that's D24. Is that the one that my ship's on? I don't even remember. I should, because if it is 24, that's kind of my number. So you would think I remember it, but I actually don't have any specific attachment to 24. I just kind of like the number randomly. I don't have a favorite number, but I've adopted 24 as my own. Why? Don't ask me. But, uh, yeah, but you still, you would think so. I mean, every time I get a soda out of the vending machine, if 24 has something I like, it's the one I pick at work. So, you know, you, you, you would think. But, besides my random rambling, uh, yeah, if I'm not mistaken, that's the chick that's sitting there talking with the buzz cut chick who is sitting there saying that her brother joined Cerberus and blah blah blah. But sure, it's what you want so bad. Have fun. And look at that, I got war assets, more of them, because I'm just such a cool guy. I don't think I got any, like, money for that, though. I sure did, and I'm still destitute as can be. So, Officer Delk. For some reason, I can talk to him and, I guess, turn in some kind of a quest. So I suppose all these ones that I'm buying from the Spectre office are stuff that, like, got locked off, and I can just... And the game's like, well, we don't want to completely screw you over. Um... This is four, right? Yeah. So... Why is whoever I need to talk to never here in this area? You'd think like with the big crowd of people, one of them would be the person, but... Nope, is it you? Nope. This is supposed to be four, are you kidding me? What's that area? It's like five. But who knows, maybe this, maybe this constitutes as four as well. Anything? Anything? Where is this this person of some kind of importance? How do we get in there anyway? Like, I notice we always go over here and push that button. I don't see like an actual an actual door though. I don't know. Officer Delk. What the hell is Delk? Delic. Is it Delic or Delk? Like, is it like a double? Things. Her name is not Delk. No, I Delic. know what I said. Deblyblick. I'm glitching out again. I don't know who the heck I'm supposed to be talking to. Who are you, and why should I care? I really have no clue. I'm gonna. I'm about to chalk it up to like a glitch or just the game being full of crap. It's probably just someone like I already talked to and it's just saying, "Hey, that person still is alive." What the game doesn't know is I really don't care unless that person has something for me. This is a problem. Up oh, here, oh. Cerberus has changed their ciphers, and our code breakers aren't getting anywhere at the moment. I've got our best teams working in shifts on it, but ensuring Citadel systems integrity is just going to take time. If we can get some of their field encryption tools, maybe sample ciphers. I understand. Keep trying. So I guess this is the guy, officer, that guy. So this entire hallway constitutes as four for whatever reason good thing I decided to check over here your intel punch right? I found these encryption codes on a Cerberus engineer I thought they might be helpful Cerberus ciphers that's exactly what we've been looking for thank you commander anytime did I get any money ho I got a little change jangling in my pocket now I feel better about myself I went from destitute to broke. Ain't that just great? I can afford, like, some fish. Maybe, if they're not rare. I can afford some common fish. I just, that's great. I couldn't, I couldn't even afford a stick of gum on the Citadel. That's, that's just how bad I was dealing. Let's go over here and go talk to Ashley. I doubt Liara has anything interesting to say. I'm sure everyone's already done what they want to do. I'll go back on the ship, say what's up, and then that'll probably be it. I'm just going to go play multiplayer. I have no idea if I feel like recording it or not. Now arriving at Presidium Commons. Because, I mean, like, I don't feel... I don't want to, like, record random people that I'm with if I want to talk to them. I might not even want to talk to anybody. Welcome just to play to play, you we know? I'm still too broke for that. This is, these stores are just too uppity and high class for little old me. I'm broke as can be. 
I am broke as can be. So where is Ashley again? She is in three, which is, I believe, down there. I guess. I get lost all the freaking time. Is she sitting where Ashley... I mean, Liara was sitting. Uh, nope. Is this three? Is this three? Kind of. Here's three. Oh, there she is. I see. Hey oh Why'd you call me out here? This is a nice spot, Ash. Liara's yeah. spot was better. All the shuttles zipping around remind me of when my dad would get ready to ship out. My mom would bundle us all up, buy us ice cream, and cart us out to the shipyard to watch his transport depart. I still have to resist waving every time a big Alliance ship flies by. <laughs> you should bring Sarah up here. I will, when she's ready. She'll like the quiet. She wasn't the loud tomboy crashing around like I was. Sounds like you were a handful. I, Maybe. Yeah, you still are. My dad got me. Jamie never met him. He would have liked you. You think so? Sure. Career military man? I'm a goddamn hero. Yeah. Yeah, he would have invited you over, cooked you something on the grill, and talked your ear off. Good times. That's that's one of my sayings. Good times. Good times. Ever think about what life would have been like outside the Alliance? Not bugging oh, me sure. all the time? Tried to rebel against the whole military family thing when I was growing up. Wow. When my dad and I got into it, I threatened to run away with the next guy that came along. Yeah. Really? He'd laugh and say, good, I'll pack your damn bags myself. <laughs> that tended to deflate me pretty quick. <laughs> he knew I'd never stray far from the family. They're everything to me. Good times, especially the part where you talked about packing your bags. It's easy to forget what we fight for. Yeah, moments like that. This was a good idea. It was? Nice to get away from the war for a while. I do feel a little guilty, though. Sure. But sometimes you have to step away or risk going crazy. Too There's late. still billows of no smoke. No argument here. Like... You're a crappy commander. Wow. You're a crappy commander. <laughs> Sir. <laughs> Copy that. Uh, <laughs> I like that. Damn right you show respect. But holy crap, you think they would like... I mean, how many days has it been? Real time, even galactic time, and they're still just like... Look at that smoke. Holy crap. Like, really? Look at that. Oh my god. Like, it's just... That cannot be conducive to health. Hear that? You hear that in the background? Coughing? See? That smoke is going to choke people out, and they're going to die. And I'm just going to sit there and say, I told you so. I'm just going to sit there and say, I told you so. If renegade right trigger option comes up, I'm taking it at that moment. Just slap him upside the face, say, I freaking told you so. I'll do it. Look at all that smoke. Yeah, Liara, what you got to say about that smoke? Look at that, this is unhealthy. Hello, Shepard. Yeah, that's what I thought. She, she agrees with me. She agrees with me. You may not understand it because you're not close like we are. Bestest friends ever, but, uh, you know, she, she agrees with me. Not healthy at all. Not healthy. For shame. For shame. Okay, so I really don't know what else there is to do. I think there's, like, one other mission to turn in. And, I mean, I'm, I'm kind of just hoping, like, I'll see Tali somewhere. Like, why is just, like, Liara, Evie, and Joker, like, the only ones that just... Sit around doing nothing all day. That and Jacob. Jacob's probably still in the same damn line. He's always in. Just. Just doing his thing. Poor Jacob. He is that line defender. You think he was in the Solarian Special Forces, right? Special Tasks Group, I should say. STG. STG, which I cannot ever help but have at least one tiny portion of my mind go to STD whenever I hear that. No offense, Solarians. It's just my immature brain cells, you know? It's a couple of them still left over, and they just like to go that route. You know, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm over here, and I'm like, what the heck did you just say about Solarian STDs? Oh, you're talking about the special tasks group. Why did I even run in here without checking the right the map to see like if there was anyone that mattered? Why? I'll tell you why, because I really wasn't paying attention. And there you go. I ain't afraid to admit it. Let's get out of here. This place reminds me of Thane, and that just makes me so sad. 
He is he is this game's Captain Awesome. He is this game's Captain Awesome. It has been decreed. Because even though he was terminally, terminally ill, approaching the end of his life, already losing breath. There's like nothing to do here. So despite all of that, he was able to give Kai Loser a run for his money. And make Kai Loser fail at his little mission. And that just makes me want to laugh at him more. Laugh with Thane all the way to that great assassination haven in the sky.